Hi, digital marketers. This is Faisal Amin. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will show you how to set up product catalog for Facebook. So let's get started. Before we start it, we have to just understand that what is catalog. A catalog is a container that holds information about the items you want to advertise or sell across Facebook and Instagram. In the e-commerce sections, you can create and manage catalog. You can create catalogs for different types of products product name, price, all of the informations you can store in your catalog. So let's get started. First thing first, if you have not a Facebook business account, just you go to your browser, just type business.facebook.com overview. So we can see that create an account options from here. You can create an account for your business. So now we have to create a catalog in our commerce manager. After completing the login process, you can find out all tool sections. Just click it and uh, find out the e-commerce manager options. So here we can see that e-commerce manager. Just click it and the uh, e-commerce manager. Click the add catalog. Here we find out the four options, which options you have to select it. So I recommend it you according to your business goal, you have to select it, these options. In my case, I selected e-commerce because my business is selling e-commerce product. I am selecting the e-commerce. And here we also see the two options. One is online product, second one is local product. So I am selecting online product. After selecting these options, go to next. And here you have to confirm that actually which under the business account we have to create this catalog. In my case, I am selecting this business account. And here you can optimize your catalog name according to your business name and whatever you can put in any kind of name. So I am just change the catalog name. I am putting my name and then create. So then click the view catalog. Now we are go to the items and then click the add items and in the add items sections we can see the four options choose your preferred options which option you have to use to upload your product in the catalog in my case i am selecting data feed because data feed is a easy process that is automatically stored to your product in the e-commerce manager so i am following the easiest process for that so after selecting the data feed i am go to the next and here we can see that use a URL or Google Sheet. Here is the inserting options of URL. So I am now back into my website and creating this URL to upload my website product in the Commerce Manager catalog. So this is my website backend in the dashboard. Firstly, we have to install a plugin, CTX Fit, that called. You just go to your plugin options and search the CTX Fit. And after the installations and the activations process, you have to find out those options. So for these options, we can go to Make Fit. And CTX Fit also provided some options for selecting your locations. So I am selected my country locations you can also select it your business locations and your country locations according to your need template will be the facebook catalog by instagram and file name you can put any kind of name according to your business name file type will be the xml and the all variations are the selected and here we can find out our facebook product options here you can see the facebook product and the value will be the your niche which niche you are using for your business in I, my case my niche is cycle so i'm just typing i'm trying to type in cycle and here you can see that is the outdoor product so i am finding my niche just selected the category and then we are just clicking update and generate Feet. The process will be running. We are done. Create a CTX feed for our website products. Now again, we have to go to our CTX feed plugins options and click the manage feeds. 
in the manage feed sections you can see that our feed is showing here so just to click the copy from it and then back to our e-commerce manager here we have to have put our url which we are created from the ctx feed plugins in our website after the inserting the url we have to go next and here is the default currency we just selected your currency and frequency will be the daily that option is allowed to you automatically updated your product in the e-commerce catalog suppose you, you are adding your product in your website that product will be automatically updated and stored in your catalog in e-commerce manager so i am selecting that daily so all of done now we are clicking the upload button so click it so after the upload your product you can see that you have a three missing uploaded and the cause is the image link is missing so you can optimize your link then again you can upload your product by ctx feed plugins and you can see 31 item already added so now we are go to in the item sections and we can see our all product is uploaded in our catalog in e-commerce manager so after the uploading your product now i am going to the event sections to connect our pixel with our e-commerce manager if you do not connect your catalog with the pixel then your ads manager do not find out that product now we are going to connect our catalog with the pixel for that we go to event and here you can see that connect to tracking now you can see the all of pixel list in the left side which pixel you have to connect with your catalog just you enable in the connections with the pixel i am enabling with the Faisal. i mean here you can see the pixel id i am just activate my pixel with the catalog after the activation i just click the save then our pixel will be connected with our catalog and after sometimes you can see that catalog mess rate will be the 90 percent we are already set up order catalog for facebook e-commerce manager and also connect with our catalog with our pixel sometimes you need to add a new catalog or create a new catalog then you can want to delete this previous catalog so how can you deleted this catalog for that you have to go to the settings options and go to the catalog and you can see that is our catalog name which we are created before the end here you can see that delete catalog options and click the delete that catalog will be the deleting so finally we upload our product to catalog in commerce manager and connect our catalog with the pixel and also we know that how to delete our catalog so thanks for watching this video i will see in the next video with a new topic thank you